name's Gordon Knight. I'm CEO of Nanochip Incorporated in Fremont, California, across the bay. We are in full product development now of a new memory chip technology. We think this is disruptive technology that will have an impact like the original floppy disk did. Uh, it's a memory chip that has basically a little XY disk drive in it. We do not depend on advanced lithography. We can use fully discounted manufacturing equipment. Our first product will have tens of gigabytes per die, and we have demonstrated in a lab that someday, four or five generations out, we will have a terabyte or more per die. So you can now think of having terabytes in your cell phone, in your iPod. Uh, we can go after pieces of the disk drive market, and we're going after the high end of the NAND flash market. So this is not program storage. This is storage for massive data, videos, YouTube, et cetera. So it's a very, very powerful storage technology. It's thousands of atomic probe tips reading and writing on a continuous media inside a chip, inside of a chip. If you see it, it would look like something like a NAND flash chip. It's about 150 square millimeters. It's much thicker. It's uh, maybe up to two, three millimeters thick. But it can be put in, it can replace disk drives. It can be put into USB drives. It can go into solid state disk drives, enterprise servers. So eventually we will go after the cell phone market also after we, our volume, manufacturing volumes going up. We're a, non, we're a fabulous semiconductor company and we're talking to two Fortune 100 companies to be our partners for manufacturing. And we're funded by Intel Capital and a few other very large firms. In my discussions with the cell phone companies, so they all want hundreds of gigabytes built into the cell phone. They do not want memory cards. They want you to purchase your your cell phone and have hundreds of gigabytes so you can keep your favorite HD movies, all of your favorite uh, YouTube videos in there. You could uh, put it in a docking station at your friend's house and transmit your H favorite HD movie onto their projector. So there's just massive amount of storage needed and you can't put disk drives in these devices. They're too fragile. They really have too much power. And NAND Flash, which is a big competitor right now, is running out of steam in, from basic physics. So there is an incredible need for a new memory technology to go beyond NAND flash and take over part of the disk drive market.